I'm Butch Townsend, and I've known Scott for a little over 30 years. Um, I'm Chris Spurry, and I met Scott over 25 years ago. Hi, I'm Laura Hykus, and I've known Scott since I was a teenager. My name is Moorhead Vermilia, and I've known Scott Beatty for uh, probably close to 30 years. Uh, I'm Patty Willis, uh, and of course it's been delightful to know Scott and his family all of these years. My name is Will Shanahan. Scott and I have known each other almost 60 years. We're hunting buddies, fishing buddies, golfing buddies, and that takes up the whole year. I think Scott's very uh, community oriented. He always looks out at different organizations and how he can improve the local community environments around him. He's intelligent. He has a pure work ethic. He's detail oriented. He is humble. And uh, it's the reason people are willing to follow him as a leader. Scott understands that a successful team does not arise by chance. It requires dedication, integrity, and collaboration. Scott certainly is an extremely hard worker, intelligent, very active in the community. And Scott has always been um, a big picture thinker. He's always been practical, reliable, uh, down to earth keys to his success would be his ability to interact with individuals and talk to them uh, openly and honestly. He doesn't sleep and he only eats lunch one day a week. Gives him a big uh, edge, a big leg up on the rest of us. Everything that he uh, turns through his mind, he's thinking forward. He's thinking for the community. He's thinking for the best of whatever the situation is. Scott's name has, has always in this community been brought up as a go-to person, a go-to to organize, a go-to to bounce ideas off of, a go-to to lead, to ask others to commit. He's been on, I think, probably every board that you can think of, and plenty I can't think of. Too numerous to name. I, I don't think he turned down many requests to help people and, and give them good advice. Uh, the big joke with Scott is that he and I both like fishing, and he was actually with me on my boat one time, just the two of us, when we caught the biggest fish uh, I ever caught on my boat. And I made the mistake of letting Scott hold the fish up in the photograph, and he's so darn big, made my fish look small, so I've been mad at him ever since. We have a co-worker here at the bank that is um, quite spooked by bugs, uh, and he likes to be a prankster and, you know, find a bug that may have crept up, and, and he'll make every attempt to get it in her path as she walked through the bank. He uh, carries a very low handicap, hits the ball a mile, and uh, is, is a very good golfer. About the only thing I can think of is, is that he's dangerous with tools on a boat. If he gets anywhere near a tool, a ladder, a boat that's too far down off a dock, you better get him a trampoline to get in there because he's somehow going to hurt himself. Uh, we have a very successful Relay for Life team at Talbot Bank, and because of generosity of people like Scott who would donate a bowl, very beautiful bowl sets that we would raffle off to raise some money for our Relay team. He took up a hobby of turning bowls. It's really an art form. I tell you, his, his work is just, it's perfect. It's, it's, it's stupefyingly good. With all the foolishness that we see in the world today, to find um, really centered, responsible people like Scott who hold values is, is refreshing and uh, really encouraging. And uh, I'm very pleased that he's being honored because I think he's uh, earned it many times over. You know, his father was a great community person, and and, and Scott has just um, uh, continued that that Beatty legacy. And you know, as a parent, I think about my children. I hope they do the same. So I think that's a kind of a legacy thing there. So it's pretty cool. We're lucky to have him in our community. I think you're lucky to have him as someone to honor today um, and help raise some money for the foundation. So good choice on your part. He's a consummate family man. When your kids all love you, you're a great family man. And he has a wonderful wife, Nancy, and together they've raised three kids, Aaron and Judd and, and, and uh, Seth, and just great kids. And they, they, they all are successful on their own and uh, a pleasure to be around. You can tell a lot about a guy by his kids. And, and uh, you could sure tell what a great guy Scott is by his.